So obviously you have to worry about him out there. But what makes Allen so good is that he can also put the ball on the floor, get into the paint, and score at that mid-range area as well. And he really has a fondness for those corners. I mean, you just can't help off of him. Too much of a threat from out there. You've got to stay connected to him. But uh, the early play in this club certainly provides for some, uh, some real proof that this could be a good team. They've looked awful good. And so it's the Suns getting on the ball oh! first. That's good. Oh, no. You know, it's easy to take it for granted because we're so used to seeing him make those kinds of plays versus the East because they did a nice job out there, but... Boy, the Western Conference was, uh, was not easy for them. And it's blocked by Gorchak. Brown on top. And it's Brown missing. Now he had a defender draped all over. Not really the best shot there. Well, not the shot you hope for when it's well contested like that. Here is Nova. He picked up 12 oh. points in the last one against the Nuggets in Denver. Yeah, not to mention four big steals on the night. He's, he's getting it done at both ends of the floor. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Well, it's good to see him with his free throw percentage up over 80% now. And you know, with those numbers, he makes a defender hesitant to get to. Himself said if they didn't win the title, it would be a box. Now, here is Gorsuch. They really needed more from him in that loss to the Lakers. No back, the pass to LeBron. Goes the slam. All business there, not messing around one bit. You think you have him contained, and he'll just wiggle around this guy for a layup. We can never act as if he has nowhere to go down low. He finds space and rules all the time. You guys? Pocket six. Pockets kicks to go time. And he finishes nicely. I'm away. He's guarded by Drogic. Novak dishes to LeBron. The feed to Novak. It's stolen by Dragic. And now here's Dragic, the fast break. Oh, oh, Tampers it on to polish off the break. That's his favorite shot, his bread and butter. Here's Dragic. Comes it up there. The alley is really very really well done. How about the soft hands right there to make that catch and lay in? An alley is usually a little bit more strength. Yeah, Jim was okay. And yeah, that was nice, too. That was a, a finesse finish that got the job done. And that one's good by Novak. Well, guys, Eric Spolster is really a young coach, but he's worked his way up from video coordinator to being one of the outstanding head coaches in the league. To be where he is, coaching one of the very elite teams in the league. You know, if their plan was to keep going inside a ton, it sure has paid off. I mean, it seems like every bucket they get is in the lane. Well, no reason to take an outside shot if you're scoring at will from inside the team. Here's Novak. Hits it to go. Novak's got 11 points. One ten left for the first quarter. He feeds it to front. Fires the three. Cole with the rebound. Yeah, he's struggled with the shot this quarter, and he's got to find a groove somehow. Johnson over the hill. Cole's shot is good. And it's an entertaining game as well, guys. And Cole kicks to Novak. That's good. Novak's got 13 points. Young prospects, but they did a nice job in the draft the last couple of years. Kendall Marshall, the new point guard. Also, uh, the big guy Morris has, uh, has looked like he's got a, a future with the club. So uh, I think they're heading in the right direction at this point. Here's what Gets down the step back, Jay. Part of his versatility is the accurate jump shot. I mean, able to spread the floor for his teammates as penetrators. And with his 6'11 height, it's a tough shot to recover to. Wow. Oh. That's not in no way. That was nice. And the highlight real replay. Brought to you by Sprite. Good stuff. Here is Nova. He's covered by Brown. Novak gets to Howard. Rebound by Marshall. That's really too easy a chance to miss, guys. He needs to be more aggressive. Novak. He's covered by Brown. There's the 
three. And the Heat, another three. Kicks to Nova. And that is good. Novak's got 20. Haslam is three. Novak dishes to Haslam. It's hauled in by the Suns. Novak dishes to Haslam. Low scoring blinded out game. They weren't that time at least. Here's Novak, and the basket good. Novak's got nine points now in the quarter. Making a change here. Gortat's checked in. And Miami also making a switch. Bosch is checked in. And it's blocked by Gortat. Bosch gets the pass to Morris. And that's good. He passes to Morris. There's one for three. It's rebounded by Bosch. Bosch has got his fifth rebound in this one. Here is Novi. Gortat covering. Goes up with it. And it's Miami with another. And the first half is now in the books. He lead by 10. And coming up after the break, it'll be Damon Bruce breaking down all the highlights from the first half of play. And now, brought to you by Sprint. The fun has begun on this Saturday night, and we're ready to look back at all the first half action. Miami up on top against the Suns out at U.S. Airways Center. A strong beginning to the season. They've wasted no time in getting off on the right foot. The machine has been locked in so far. What he's been able to do from the field has been nothing short of spectacular. Only a select few players in the league can shoot the ball like that. And the Suns going all out. They've done a fantastic job pushing the break in the tempo. Easy buckets in transition. Some textbook basketball from Shannon Brown. He's got 17 points and it's been bombs away from outside. And we'll be heading back to the court for the rest of our coverage as we go to Kevin Harlan, Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke for the second half of the point. LeBron James is out there with Chris Bosh, Alex Allen, and it's Banier in at the three seconds. Well, everybody knows about the big three in Miami with James Bosh and Wade. I think the question goes... And along with the rest of his Heat teammates, Chris Bosh has heard his share of criticism. People knock him for not being aggressive enough offensively with leading players in the one team. I think Bosh has been a really nice addition for the Heat. LeBron by LeBron. There's the bucket good. LeBron's now got four this quarter. And Steve, for Chris Bosh, one thing he has said offensively is he doesn't like missing shots. He said, I can make three of them. And then if I miss two, I feel like I'm blowing it. What do you think of it? <laughs> well, I like that attitude of perfection. That's what makes the really good players great. I mean, you know, that's really not the mentality of big-time scorers in the league, but based on where Bosh is and who he's playing with, that's fine. I think it works. Gets it to go. Gortat with the screen for Dudley. Gortat is off the beat, and he comes off the screen and spins it through. Man, good call, Kevin. That was really the key to the play. The Suns making a switch here. O'Neal's checked in. Again, the Heat, good for two. Well, this has been a game for him to forget, so far anyway. We'll see if he can pick it up. Here is Nova. He's covered by Brown. Leans. And that one's good by Novak. In for the Suns. Heat also with the sub. Ray Allen, he's checked in for Mario Chalmers. Here's Novak. And so he runs a trip to the line. Officials on the contest. And he'll shoot two. You know, it's a little strange to not have the Suns in the playoffs for a consecutive year. Last year, they came close, but ended up finishing three games back of the eighth playoff spot. Goran Dragic has checked in for the past couple decades. But even two years with no playoffs seems like a drop for them. Mm -hmm. You thought it was the first game you were the to He dishes it to Brown. Second shot opportunity. Rebound by the Heat. Next up in the dock at the Bucks following this one. That'll be the first of four played at home for them. And no doubt the Milwaukee fans want to see the Bucks take that game. The only concern going from this point on. And that's a pretty short list of concerns to have if you're a team. I mean, the Heat will always have to worry about depth to some degree, given how they're built around the big three. 
Fades back. No good from Trogic. Well, I think he kind of alligator arm that from short stroke. After doing a nice job to get open, he didn't finish that. He kicks it to Nova. LeBron is screen on Brown. Six to shoot. And finished off by LeBron. They get a ton of rebounds, so Bosch doesn't necessarily have to do a bunch of glass eating. Battier kicks to Novak. From the wing, and the Heat get another bucket right there. He's real presence defensively inside. Here is Novak. Gortat covering. And that one's good by Novak. Well, this has been one-sided so far, both on the rebounding side and the scoreboard. Bosch, the screen. No bad, the pass to Bosch. That is good. If he did that, I really thought he could be an explosive score around the rim and on the perimeter. No bad, kicks to Lewis. A three-pointer is right on target. Here is no Lewis on the way. Three-pointer, and again, Miami with the triple. Excellent performance in tonight's game. In case you hadn't heard, you set your career high in points. How did it feel to be on such a roll on offense? Uh, I didn't feel too different out there. I was just doing what seemed natural, taking shots when I felt it made the most sense. It's nice to set a career best, but now I got to keep living up to that, so maybe it's not such a great thing after all.